This is business as usual at the State Office of Unclaimed Property. Their most recent acquisition, bats, and lots of them. It's been very nerve-wracking for everyone, especially when they come flying down the hall and right at your head and you just duck down to the ground or you run in your office and slam the door. I have never really seen a bat in the downtown area until last Friday. Didn't know they were around. Last Friday, employees found one bat flying around here in the office, but by Monday morning, there were more than 30 bats in here. And they're still here, hanging from window blinds, flying around in offices. Sometimes they even crawl out from behind computers. For the people who work here, this stopped being funny a long time ago. Every door you go through, you have to look around. You have to, before you enter the elevators, before you enter the restrooms. On fourth floor, there was one in the toilet, and they thought it was drowned, and it flew up at her. It's a frightening thing. Then there's the bat droppings on everyone's desk each morning. Employees are burning candles to mask the stench. Everyone here wants to know, how long will the bats be hanging around? Depends on how many bats you have and where they're at. That could mean at least another week of frazzled nerves in the state office they're now calling the Bat Cave. Karen Compton, 2 News, Salt Lake City.